Uh, start with the dollar. I mean, recently we saw the dollar edge higher. Uh, it's, it had some strength against the backs basket of currencies, more specifically this week, but we've seen it for a while. And then suddenly PMI data comes in yesterday weaker. People are expecting a lot from tomorrow's uh, Federal Reserve speech during the um, Jackson Hall. And then that's that's gone back to weaker. And, you know, there's a lot to untie there. What are you seeing there? What's going on? What are we expecting moving forward? Yeah, so I think it was last week. It, it was a very uh, like 2022 kind of week. And uh, and 2022 for most of that year, I sort of described the dollar as the wrecking ball for risk assets. So if you look at sort of the chart of the dollar, you know, first three quarters of 2022, the average week was dollar up and pretty much everything else down. And I think that was such the trend in the market during that period. It changed yeah. quite a bit, obviously, in the fourth quarter of last year, right? Weaker dollar, stronger risk assets. And that's kind of been the story going into 2023. But really, after the first couple of months of 23, it's really been more of a range bound dollar more than anything. So you've seen a bit mm -hmm. of, of a nice rally here recently. And last week in particular, you had a stronger dollar as everything else was coming off. And I think if there's a risk to where we're at now, in the seasonally weakest part of the calendar year for stocks, which is August and September, usually leading into a fall low, a stronger dollar, I think, further from what we've seen so far would really put an exclamation point on that uh, potential scenario where, where a stronger dollar really um, you know, hurts other risk assets and, and causes other things to uh, basically depreciate in, uh, in value. So I think the, the bounce in the dollar here uh, most recently is a potential emerging uh, theme but when I take a step back from the chart, I'm struck by actually how sideways the trend has been really mm. for the last six months or so.